Life in HD from WVUE TV New Orleans. This is Fox 8 News at 6. You're watching Fox 8 News. Time now, 844. You can enjoy many of your favorite holiday foods without actually adding on extra pounds. There are a few tricks, though, that you need to know, and dietitian Julie Soviak from Turo is here with some easy modifications <laughs> that are still going to taste great but keep us from uh, inching up there on the scale, right? right? <laughs> well, thanks for having me. Julie. Well, we're thrilled. Um, you, you've brought an amazing display, and you're starting right. with a king cake. Right, yes. What we have here are just a few simple ingredients that you can modify to some of your favorite holiday recipes that will definitely help cut down on your calories and fat. So the first ingredient we have here is oil. Now I know a lot of our favorite desserts like bread pudding and a lot of your baked goods usually tend to call for a lot of oil in the recipes. So one easy modification would be to switch out an equal amounts oil for applesauce. Really? Right, definitely. And you're still going to get that same consistency. However, if you substituted half a cup of oil for half a cup of applesauce, that's going to decrease your calories by 925. No way. Way. So that's equivalent to a nine inch slice of king cake. So I can eat all this just by a piece right. of apple. Just by it, cutting down to the applesauce. Does it stay together as well? Right. The applesauce is still going to give you that same consistency as you would get with oil. Now some recipes you still need that fat for a lot of the functional properties like texture and flavor. So another alternative would just be to cut down on the amount of called for oil or butter by 25 or 50 percent and save a lot of calories that way too. Don't go all in don't cut right. all the oil out, just have Right, it. just okay. a little bit. You really want to experiment with those substitutions to get that recipe perfected. So make it for yourself before you make it for all right. your family coming Definitely. over for Christmas. Try it out before you bring it to a party. Right. Okay, Beignets. so next what we have here is sugar. Now, sugar provides you with a lot of what I call empty calories, meaning for all those calories we consume, you don't really get any nutritional benefits. Mm -hmm. So a healthier substitution would be to use Splenda Sugar Blend. Okay. Now, what's great about this product is it still contains some regular sugar, which is needed for a lot of your functional properties in your baking goods. However, it cuts down on the calories and sugar by half. So if you substituted one cup of regular sugar for just half a cup of the Splenda blend, you would save 384 calories. That is huge. Right, which is equivalent to about seven powdered donuts. <laughs> Yum. And we were talking about maybe doing half and half with the oil. Can you right. substitute all your sugar for Splenda or, or is right. that a good... Right, because this still contains some okay. of the regular sugar in addition to Splenda, the sugar substitute. Okay. Perfect. So all in on this one. Right. Okay, so next we have heavy cream. Now cream is packed with a lot of calories and a lot of fat. And we use this in a lot of our soups and favorite bisques like crawfish corn bisque. I made tomato soup this weekend and used cream. <laughs> right. <laughs> but a better alternative would be to use evaporated skim milk, which is definitely going to cut down on a lot of that fat. So if you replaced one cup of the heavy cream with one cup of evaporated skim milk, that would save you 744 Jeez. calories, which is equivalent to a full dinner plate of food. A whole other meal. <laughs> right, an entire meal. Wow. But you just really want to substitute with these and try to experiment because only through trial and error are you really going to get that recipe perfected. Wonderful. Awesome tips. And mm -hmm. then um, eggs and... Right. Talk. And here's just another few uh, easy ingredients you can substitute. Instead of one whole egg, you could easily just substitute and use two egg whites, or you can use a fourth a cup of egg beaters. And that's okay. definitely going to cut down on that cholesterol. Oh, that's always good. And how about sour cream? Can you really substitute sour cream? Oh, definitely. These are very simple, subtle modifications that you can make where people really even aren't going to notice a change mm -hmm. in the taste. Perfect. And, and what are you using to substitute the sour cream with? Is... You can use light sour cream. Light sour cream. Okay. Or you can even use fat-free sour cream would be another alternative and as well. And too. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Wonderful. Julie Soviak with Turo, thank you for all your oh, great ideas. and Thanks for having me. Helping keep us healthy this holiday season. <laughs> Appreciate your time. Thank you. You can find all of Julie's tips on our website, fox8live.com. By the way, Fox 8 wants to help you eat a little bit healthier all year long. So we're going to do this segment again, and we'd love to hear from you about what recipes you'd like Julie to make over. Which ones do you want her to tell you what to substitute? Just email your favorite recipe to us at recipes at fox8tv.net. And coming up on future segments, we'll tell you how to give your meals a healthy makeover.